How you doing? It's Ryan with 1075. Come check out this week's build showcase of these twin 2021 Ford F-150 paramedic vehicles. We're checking out these two 2021 Ford F-150s for Atlantic Ambulance. These are their paramedic response vehicles. They tasked us with downsizing their existing vehicles so that they can fit into tighter spaces, reduce cost, and be more of a practical application for what they're looking to do. You can see the two vehicles we're showcasing. One is in park, one is in our drive response mode. You can see headlight flashers activated along with a different light bar pattern bringing in our white flash. And then you can see when we're in park, sync up with the rest of the vehicle. Up top, sound off signal and roads light bar, M powers on the front fender, M powers in the grill, sound off headlight flasher, custom graphics package to max their existing fleet. You'll see up top the Dometic air conditioning unit. This is to heat and air condition the rear cabinet for any pharmaceuticals or their equipment that's back here. What's different on this unit than our other vehicles that we've done for them and some other paramedic vehicles is this will run all the time. We've installed a battery system along with an inverter to power the HVAC unit. So that way this is constantly uh, temperature controlled. You can see we've brought in sound off signal strip lights, some techniques down below. We've got pin switches on all the doors. Those are what indicate that the um, truck doors are open and it indicates in the front cab on that also. We did M-Power three inches across the top, amber arrow, white reverse, tricolor M-Powers on the rear bumper, same thing, tricolor red, blue, white, white for reverse, rear scene. We have a backup camera installed for them. We have graphics to match the rest of their fleet. We reintegrated the backup camera from the tailgate to the hatch, so they still have all that factory function. Technique indicator lights to give them some warning when the rear hatch is open. And what we've installed here on the hatch is a handle, as you can see. We made out of webbing, all done in house. Uh, it's for the shorter people, so they can kind of work it down, get to it. I know I'm a little taller, but if somebody were short here, they can kind of just run back and then they're able to close the hatch. Looking at the back, similar to their uh, Suburbans that we did for them, very functional. They're very happy with the design. It gives them a, a lot of room without having to sacrifice everything from some of what the traditional paramedic cabinets were that you're used to seeing. Due to space, we custom made the drawer slide outs out of aluminum, 316s, TIG welded in-house. Cabinets wider than it normally would be because we were able to maximize the space that's in here. And then the cabinet's actually not on a slide out, it's fixed. So the only thing that slides out is the drawers. And then the cabinet has plugs on it so that we can disconnect our Technique scene lights and our 110, 12 volt uh, outlets and stuff and remove the cabinet to better service the inverter and the batteries. 60 inch Acuride, 600 pound drawers, full extension both sides. Due to this only being a five and a half foot bed, we have a storage for a folding backboard. And then you can see that we custom made HDP panels to go on the sides and give them a flat surface and it boxes out our inverter and battery bank. From the other side, all the same material gives them access to any equipment that they're gonna be mounting here. They've got their charging uh, port that's wired to the inverter. So the HVAC unit, the inverters will all, or the outlets will all work when the truck is off. Cosmo 30 amp shoreline to power the inverter and the air conditioning unit when the vehicle is parked, also maintaining the battery. New 2021 Ford F-150 console recessed out around the outlets and trailer brake controller and the trailer controller that's on the dash, a little different from the other ones. 12 volt USB outlets, radios mounted, custom cutout, blueprint controller, pen pocket holder, large binder storage, adjustable armrests, RAM mount for their uh, tablet. And then on the driver's side, we have control of their uh, inverter system along with the Dometic controller for the air conditioning unit in the back. Thanks for checking out this week's build showcase. If you have any questions about these vehicles, please feel free to reach out to us. Uh, please also feel free to comment on the video. We're happy to answer any questions. Please don't forget to share and subscribe.